What's up, guys? We're back here on our road to Dark Aether on my second account. In our last video, our top comment was from Steven. It's like, you already know it was from Cam, saying that he wants us to get the Howard done on Mauer. And also, shout out to Jason. I know he's left this comment a few times. Was close to getting top comment, but it's hard to get it when Cam is like the Tom Brady of getting top comment around here. So today, we'll be getting the Howard done on Mauer. Now, I'm pretty sure we actually have quite a bit to do here. I have it level 33, but my camel progress, I don't have too much done. I only have 700 kills with it. Uh, we only have 180 crits out of the 2,500 that we need. Uh, 465 kills out of 2,500 pack-a-punch kills. Vintage is done. Fauna is not. So we need to get 10 kills rapidly three more times. Topo is also not done. We need a lot more crits and we need to get all of our Jackrabbit kills. So this is going to be a little tough. Also, if we go to my skills here, I do have my shotguns tiered up to tier five, but even with it tier five, you don't get the 10 attachments like you do with every other weapon class or most other weapon classes, but you do get increased armor penetration bonus, increased crit damage, close corners bonus, all that good stuff. But we're going to have to choose our attachments here very carefully. So I think what we're going to do is the, not the duck build choke, but maybe the agency choke. Just get increased drop rate, better hip fire accuracy, and a tighter ADS spread. The sprint to fire and the effective damage range does not bother me at all if that's down. Now the barrel is something I, I need to pick carefully because with our lancer barrel we get more armor damage but tiered up it already does more armor damage with the reinforced heavy we get more damage range and a faster fire rate the ranger we get oh wait i don't want to save that the ranger we get more effective damage range but our aim walking movement speed is heavily affected hammer forged we get more fire rate and task force is more damage but the 15 percent damage increase with the task force i don't i don't know what to go with i think we might have to do task force so yeah that's what i'm gonna go with task force with our body we're gonna put on the ember sighting point for more salvage drop drop magazine eight round tube in the stock i would go with the marathon pad because it, it increases everything and only decreases our hip fire but we don't have it unlocked so we have to go with the sas combat stock and i think that's a pretty good build but i don't know what field upgrade to go with here tesla storm could be nice because this thing does take a while to reload but because it takes a while to reload aether shroud could be good because it instantly reloads our weapon for us when we activate it and then also there's always ring of fire so maybe i'll just switch between the few here but for now i'll just go tesla storm but with all that out of the way let's go ahead hop on mauer and get this done but i always wait to say this until we're way too deep in the video i always forget but if you guys have any weapon suggestions that you want to see me get done make sure you leave it in a comment below as well as the map you want me to play on i'll, I'll have a comment there as well of what weapons we already have complete so we don't get any repeats so go ahead and drop those here we go Flying into Mauer. Let's see if we can get this done. Okay. All right. It looks like our controls are fine. If you guys don't know, in uh, last video, we we started a challenge series because of the comments you guys have been leaving on, on my Dark Aether videos. Like, it, it turned into you guys just, like, giving me insane challenges to do. So, we're like, okay, well, let's go ahead and do that in a different series. That way, we can still get camos and not uh, be struggling the whole time. But I have been seeing a lot of you guys leaving comments saying that I should get a weapon from level one all the way to Dark Aether in the same game. And I don't think that's possible, at least not in round base. There is very little, like, weapon XP that you get in zombies it used to be completely broken i don't remember what season it was i think it was like season one it was super early into the game where you could get a lot of weapon xp just by playing round base and now you hardly get any like there's times where i'll come in here i'll play for like 60 rounds and only get like a few weapon levels like it's real bad like as much as i would like to do that and that that would be the way i'd get every weapon done is from like nothing all the way to dark aether it's just not possible even with like double XP and like the PlayStation bonus of having like that extra XP for playing with friends and stuff, I still, it's not, I don't think it's, you can do it. But let's make sure we're focusing on our crits here. They're very tough to get with shotguns. I really need to get dead shot like fast. Also, let's grab this loose change and start making our way towards power. I had to go check that wall by it was an MP5 because a lot of the time there is going to be like a shotgun wall by on these maps or at least most of the maps have one. So if I can just buy that and get an easy tier upgrade like early, I'm down for it. But I, I, I just can't remember any of the wall buys. I hardly ever get wall buys in this game. Where's our Tempest? Oh, there it is. Speak of the devil. Get two shot at idiot. Grab this loose change from Jug. Come on. One more. Jeez, it's so hard to get crits with this. Shotguns are so good in zombies. I'm I'm glad we're finally onto the shotguns. Just the worst part about them is trying to get headshots. The pellet spread's so wide. All right, now let's go down this way. Normally I go down the stairs, but dead shots over here and I need it. I'm gonna literally just sit right by here until I have enough to get dead shot before we do anything else. Where are the zombies at? Are they all still up? Come on, get down here. Finally, the round's over. How much do we need for oh we need to turn on power never mind so i guess we do need to get power on before we do anything uh oh here comes the trains we made it across though oh shit we'll just hold our ground right here 
Oh, bonus points. That'll help us. I think we can open this now. We're gonna need a little bit more cash to get into here, though. So zombies, go ahead, spawn faster. With that shotgun, basically the whole time, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a one-shot kill on almost everything. The elites might be a little more than a one-shot, but this is gonna do massive damage to them. Pretty sure for a, the longest time, the Howard was probably, like, the best weapon in zombies. Oh, as soon as I'm saying it's gonna one-shot, it didn't one-shot. There's our grudge camo, 750 kills. We still have a lot to go. So much to go, actually. Grab this loose change. Throw that on. Pack shut up. Yeah. Cool, bitch. You screwed up the easiest task you have all day? Lick toes, dude. Grab this loose change. We still need more money to open this. Let's just take out the rest of these bad boys. What we got? Max ammo? I'll take it. Ooh. All right, now we can open this. Tempest? Watch this. One, two. Gone. Sleep. Now let's make our way in here. Throw that in. Throw the lever down. Easy peasy. All right, can we upgrade it all? Let's get this to green. Keep that damage up. And we can't upgrade anything else right now. Let's go ahead and try to get Pack-A-Punch on. And then I guess we can just sit by our Wonder Fizz. I did want to get the, the dead shot straight from the machine, but we do not have enough money. And we'll have enough by the time we, we get done with this. And then we can just grab it from Wonder Fizz. It'll be a lot easier. Let's just Tesla Storm. Get those points up. Let's reload, though. We just killed everything with Tesla Storm. That's sick. Oh, we got enough to get dead shot. That's the nice thing about Tesla Storm is I got to reload. I can just stand there and just gain points instead of like with Aether Shroud. It'll instantly reload my weapon, but I get no points out of it. So there's dead shot. Oh, there we go. Now we're getting our crits. What we got? Double points? Yes, sir. I think we need speed cola next. Let's grab it. I don't want insta-kill. With the way the bullet spread is on this, it's not worth it. I'll only grab it in like an emergency. But now all we gotta do is save up our cash. Oh, we got a jackrabbit medal. We gotta be close to getting another one of those jackrabbit camos. The Hauer is the, the the only weapon I can really see speed cola having an effect on. Every other weapon, it seems like the reload increase is so minimal. But with the Hauer, it's like bam, 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 bam. We're full. I mean, it's still slower than a lot of other weapons, but it's more noticeable on this. Let's see. What can we grab? Let's start getting Mule Kick. That way we don't have to pick up ammo. This is such a weird perk starting combination, but I, I, I feel very confident in using the Howler. Ooh, level 34 now. <laughs> this is the easiest spot in the game. Oh, wait, hold on. The second I start saying something, I start getting hit. Oh, our Amphibian Camo, 250 crits. And our Sunder Camo. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Why? Why? I have the worst commentator's curse. Oh, this is the best spot in the game. Gets hit, falls off the map. Fucking idiot, dude. Let me get quick revive now. I'm so stupid. I can't believe I did that. I knew when I said I was feeling confident with the gun, something bad was bound to happen, and it did. It happened fast. We're about to get a Panzer coming in here soon. I can feel it. I'm gonna go see if I can get armor. Do I have enough salvage for that? I have no salvage at all, actually. That's such a, like a good spot for grinding camos, but a bad spot for trying to get any pickups. Oh yeah, we still don't have enough salvage for anything. So let's try to open all these little dig spots up. We unlock pistol skills. I still can't believe they reset everything. I don't think that was their intention, but uh, it's kind of annoying. At least we're only working on like guns that we haven't used before. Because if I wanted to change like a loadout or something to a weapon, I'd be pissed. Double points. Let's go. Right as the round's ending. All right, we got 5k. Let's just get Pack-A-Punch right now. This is what the Hauer looks like on Mauer with Pack-A-Punch 1. Very nice. This is probably the... Oh, I don't even know. It's like this in Forsaken has the best like triple. The... the trio of pack punch camos but i just heard the panzer spawn there's our boy look at this damage we're doing to him already gone oh we got a calling card for that too this thing is just so lethal pack a punch it's ridiculous shut up pack i i can't wait for the next like game that peck is in and i want i just want to see him dead I, I want there to be a boss battle against peck where he's using some like robot he made or something and he's a mech and we take him out It'll be so satisfying. So I've just been butting heads with this guy for a whole like year and a half now. All right, let's get Mule Kick back. And honestly, let's head on down. I'm gonna take the fall damage here. Don't die. Thank you. But let's head on down to Electric Room and see if we can survive down there. Do we have enough scrap yet? Oh, we can finally get armor. We have 132 crits out of 226 possible. That's not too bad. I'm gonna Tesla Storm. We're gonna get this going. We gotta get these crit numbers up. Ooh, I actually get so many points from Tesla Storm. It's ridiculous. What? Did I accidentally open that door? No! That's not what I wanted to do. That's awful. I just ruined this whole room. What the fuck? That sucks. Close. I, I wish I could just grab the doors and close them. Man, I, I guess we have to go back to Wonder Fizz, but I wanted to use this room because all the zombies are going to be flat ground and we'll actually get drops from them. I guess we can still use it, but we just have to be more 
cautious. Those zombies can spawn behind us. Honestly, it's not that bad for now. It's just if we wanted to stay down here at a higher round, it would suck. Like, we can still use it. It's gonna be a little slower and a little more dangerous. But let's just try to make hay while we have our double points going. Getting all these done. I'm so disappointed that this is open. Stupid, dude. You know what? Might as well just go give the battery to Klaus while we're here. There you go, buddy. Ooh, contamination camo. We just gotta start getting all these crits up. So we just got our, what's it called? Jackrabbit medals. We're almost done with all those, but crits, we are so far behind on. It's ridiculous. Let's just test the storm now. It's so nice. It's like having a stun that just constantly gives you points. Yeah, we got we got 17k. I think we can head back up, grab our perks, and then we'll be good to go. We can upgrade too. Let's get blue on this. Can't do more than that, I don't think. Yep, that's as far as we can go at the moment. All right, what can we grab? Let's grab Jug, Death Perception, and Stamina Up. We can get back to work. I should probably put an ammo mod on this pretty soon. I don't know what I'd put. Probably Cryo. That's what we normally do while we're grinding. Level 35 with it now. We finally unlocked our Marathon Pad. There's so much to do. But there's our Glitch Camo. All right, round 15. Let's go get an ammo mod on this bad boy. And there's Cryo. Oh, I forgot about Tormentor rounds. Sleep, not even an issue. Gone, gone. Sleep, rest in peace. Um, go to bed again. Gone. Don't tell me there's still more. Come on, there we go. Easy max ammo. See, a thousand more points and we'll get the last perk that we need for today. And then we can just use all that money to save up and get our pack of punch tiers. Kind of want to turn the Rampage and do some on. I want to see how that goes with the shotgun. So I, I'm fine with like the damage and everything and the fire rate of the shotgun. It's just a reload that I'm scared of uh, getting me killed. Oh, what's up, Panzer? I don't even need a field upgrade for you. Shotgun's just too crazy. Yeah, I think to spice it up, we will uh, go ahead and put on the rampage inducer after this round. I need these crits at the moment. Oh, max ammo. Don't need to reload. Perfect. Oh, they're just feeding me crits. Look at this. Bam. Bam. Hold on. Reload. Bam. Oh, that wasn't one. Bam. Bam. There's still one guy left. I'll go turn on the rampage inducer while it's just him. I always forget I got to open this back up. Let's go up the rope and turn this on. Head right across because I'm not waiting for the cooldown. And while we're over here, can we upgrade anything? We can upgrade our armor to two. Oh, and three. Let's do that. And now we are back home. Just got to grab our last perk, which is PhD. And we'll get elemental pop later once things start getting a little too hairy for us. This is still so nice. Disciple instantly gone. Everything's just one tap. So we don't even need it to kill. First, we need a stun though. So we can reload. And it's back to the grind, baby. Oh. There we go. Perfect timing on the Tesla storm. This gun is so busted in zombies. Literally just insta-killing everything. Oh, conviction camo. Let's go. All done with our jackrabbit medals. A stun right now. We also got our downfall camo. 750 kills while it's packed. Gotta keep stunning. Stun again. We almost have our Tesla storm back. I'm gonna stun one more time. Stunning again. Come on. One more stun. And then if I get this kill right here. Easy Tesla storm. I need to get to that double points because this is insane points if I can get to it. Let me there. Let me over there. There we go. Oh no, the round ended as I picked it up. All right, zombie spawning fast please thank you let me get these points oh we're still going in we're still eating okay got a stun though that's our last stun all right let's leave Oof. it's this reload that's gonna kill us but since we left let's go ahead and grab pack two i'll show off the camo in a minute but right now we just gotta survive this thing is a monster you know what? let's train down here for a minute so we can get our salvage up one shot how many kills we get just one i was thinking with the, the spread we might get more but i guess it's fine if we're going for crits more guarantees of crit all right this is what the hower looks like with pack a punch two here on mauer very very nice it looks really good on the barrel. It's like almost a different pattern entirely. It's like a mixture of the two. Uh-oh. We got Tormentors coming in. They seem so slow compared to the Sprinter Zombies. All right. Let's head right back up. I don't have any stuns though, but we do have a Tesla Storm to work with. Oh, here we go. Tesla Storm right now. Literally nothing can touch us. Not even this Disciple or this Panzer. This is such a good spot until this Tesla Storm runs out. Then we're in trouble. I just gotta make sure I stay somewhat close to these zombies. That we're not losing range so the damage doesn't fall off and to make sure that we're still getting crits. We gotta stay up close and personal with these guys. What we got up here? Anything that we can use? I don't think so. Get off me, zombie. All right, this Tesla Storm can't come any sooner. We gotta leave. Damn, I need to buy stuns back. Monkey Bomb works too. Actually, no, it doesn't. It's way too slow. Let's head up here and see if we can buy stuns without dying. I don't think so. We gotta get out of here. Oh, there we go. It's got a PhD metal there. We have our Tesla Storm though. We can survive up here for a second. We buy Hellhound or Tormentor. Basically the same thing. Max ammo, perfect. No need to reload. Okay, dropping down. There's not that many zombies left. I don't think more are spawning, so now we can get our stuns. There we go. Come on down, zombies. Don't be shy. Okay, this zombie has no health, and he's slowed. Let's see if we can afford a self-revive. We can, let's go. We got it back. 
Come up here, young man. Should leave. Oh, and we have enough to get pack three. So we should go do that after this round. But for now, we're getting crits. We have we still have so many to get. We're only at 472. We need basically all of them. We need all like 2,500. Stun. I'm so close to going down. So I'm gonna stun again. One more time. Let's try to get these kills so we can get the Tesla storm going. Almost there. There we go. Look at look at all these points. Watch the points just rack up. We're already at 45,000. Tesla storm's about to run out though. So I gotta dip. Let's train these guys up. Get this disciple out of here. I know there's another disciple. Where'd you go? Sleep. And now we head up. Is this thing not one-shotting anymore? That's concerning. Oh no, I think it is. Some of them have armor or are buffed by the disciple. Okay. Let's go ahead, hit the zip line and grab pack three. And then see if we can upgrade anymore. There's pack three. This is what pack three looks like on the Hower. It's beautiful and it matches with these gloves perfectly. This is so nice, actually. It's cool on this on the Hower. It looks like the barrel has like a combination of both the pack punch patterns. Very, very nice here. Let's kill this guy, see if we can upgrade at all. Repair our armor and we can't upgrade. Upgrade. That's a shame. And we're back home. Oh, shit. It's getting kind of crazy here now. Max ammo. Perfect. Let's Tesla storm. Panzers have been no issue so far today. They're just another kill to me. Let's just hit the zip line and reload. Our Tesla storm's wearing off anyways. Honestly, once you hit round 30, I'm going to turn off the rampage inducer because we did not reload fast enough to keep up with all those sprinters. We can take a few right now, but once every zombie that spawns becomes a sprinter, it's going to be like near impossible. Uh-oh. My controller battery's low, and I'm pinned in a corner. I got a nade here. Okay. Let me grab my charger. All right, controller is plugged in now. We're ready to go. Bonus points. Bring those here. We're still only at 500 crits. This is going to take forever. Now might be the time to get elemental pop, honestly. Let's do it. Oh my god, please. Oh, mangler? Immediately gone. One shot at him. The Hauer is disgusting. Bloodshed camo. 1,500 kills with it. We still need 1,000 more from here. Double points. Let's go. Our boundary camo. 750 crits the zip line and we're getting challenges done disciple needs to get out of here same with this mangler jeez so many zombies out here get the hell out of my way this is a little tougher than i thought it was gonna be Ooh. oh reload a little faster please okay that's the storm and now it's time to go in i forget how good shotguns are in this game I, it's definitely a balanced thing that it takes so long to reload because otherwise if this was full auto and didn't take so long to reload like the street sweeper oh my god no one would use any other weapon i don't think Oh, Shatter Blast. No. Elemental Pop. That's that's where it comes into play and you don't want it to. Just took so many crit opportunities off the table for us. Oh, you know what? I never put in my prediction for when I think I'll be done. And honestly, it's going to be a long time. It might be like 46. That is such a high round to get finished. What's up, Panzer? With Tesla Storm and it killed the Panzer. Damn, I need those crits. I kind of want to try this with Ring of Fire. So I know it's going to be nice. Okay, we got to go. Got to leave. We still haven't gone down besides us just jumping off right into a horde of zombies. So we're not doing bad. Ooh. Yeah, you know what? Let's see how Ring of Fire goes. Let's start building it up. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Nate on the ground. I had to talk about not going down and then immediately go down after talking about it. Come, come here. What? Electric Cherry, get him. Come on. I ain't wasting the self-revive. There we go. Let's go right back up. We got to grab everything back. There we go. All of our perks are back. Quick recovery there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There's nothing but yellow text. Look at that. Disgusting. That was filthy. Let's go see if we can upgrade anything. I don't think we can, but we can try. We might be able to get purple on this. Yes, we can. And we can repair our armor. There we go. Mangler, out of here. And we're back with a ring of fire. So let's try to hold these guys off for as long as we can and then use the ring of fire. Hey, ring of fire time. Shoot, shoot the gun, shoot the gun. I still feel like the fire rate's too slow for it. At least we don't have to reload. We have <laughs> brain rot camping over here. Let's go. And a max ammo, perfect. But I don't think ring of fire is the best move for this. But Tesla Storm doesn't seem to do that well either. Like there's not really a good field upgrade that pairs well with this. Oh, maybe maybe I'm wrong. Maybe ring of fire is better because we did get it really fast there. It just feels like it, it shoots so slow. Okay, round 30, we did it. Uh, Should we go turn off rampage inducer? Uh, Maybe after after this round. We'll give it one more. I didn't mean to pick up this insta-kill. Might as well get some use out of it. Actually, let's just make our way there now. It'll make our life a lot less stressful. It was a nice, like, what, 10 round span that we had it on? Not too bad. It's 746 crits out of 100 or 1,264 possible. It's not awful, but it's still gonna take forever for us to get this done. The rampage inducer is now off. Disciple sleep. But you know what? Hold on. I'm gonna try to survive here for a second. Make our way back to spawn room. Come on, cool down faster. There we go. Let's check on the bubbles. Yeah, it still bubbles up up in here. I feel like it makes a different sound too. Maybe you have to kill zombies in this room. What if I just discover the Easter egg here? Probably not though. Probably not. Definitely not. A lot of zombies. Taking the zip line down. We're out. On our way back to our spot, we're going to go repair our armor. We're going to need 800 more blue salvage if we want to upgrade this thing again. All right, here we go. It's 
it's repaired. I don't know why the turret decided to go on to us the second we go to repair, but it's all right. We made it out. And now I'm pretty sure we're we're good to stay up here and survive. Ring of fire time. Why does it feel like it shoots so much slower in a ring of fire for some reason? Maybe those double points. Okay, yeah, ring of fire is definitely the better choice. Oh no. Nate at the ground. Bark at the moon. All right, I'm gonna go buy decoys because we're gonna need them for whenever we reload. And we just get so overwhelmed up there. There we go. Where's this last zombie? Why is it all the way over here stuck? It says it's right here. Does it not? Why is the ground red? You see this? It's stuck on the ground right here. Oh, it was a disciple that was like invisible. Okay, that's new. Made it to round 30 though. All right, we have a ring of fire ready. We have three decoys now. We should be big chilling now. I'm throwing the decoy. Go ahead, get on that. I'm gonna reload. We have a full mag now. So time to ring of fire. Holy shit, that's a lot of zombies. Oh my Lanza. Hit the zip line. Ooh, barely got out of there with 16 health. Jeez. Let's go back up. Our ring of fire is definitely gone by now. Yep, that's kind of a waste. So I don't know what's best anymore. I kind of want to go back to Tesla Storm because then it's like a built-in stun. I don't want it to take all my kills. What? Oh, that's the worst part about this. Me trying to reload and then hitting the zip line. I just wasted that decoy. That sucks. Throw the decoy down just so I can get those extra kills and nope. You're hitting the zip line. Let's buy some more. Get out of here. While we're over here, we'll repair the armor. All right. Can we survive up here now? We have a Gersh on the ground in case we need it, which we might. I don't want it to take all my kills away. It's not about just surviving. We need to get these camos for our weapon. Another decoy going down. Throwing on the ring of fire this time. Yeah, we might need to go to Tesla Storm again. I'm so indecisive in this game ridiculous let's switch back to it our ring of fire experiment was fun but tesla storm will definitely keep us alive longer and we can't even afford decoys we just get zero salvage up here and sucks there's a drench camo 1500 while it's pack punch we still need a thousand more just pack a punch kills jeez i don't know how i got this thing all the way up to level 30 without getting any kills it's just like outbreak doing all the work it's so much XP and outbreak. I wish you could just buy salvage because it gets to the point where you just have so much money that you can't use and then you're not getting enough salvage to be able to get all the fun stuff like kill streaks and things like that. Because I'm going to have like by the end of this probably like 200,000 points that I'm not using. I wish I could just convert that into something. Even if it's like an insane price. Like just give me the option. Also having the option to drop salvage and points for teammates would be huge. Oh, we just unlocked the street sweeper. Let's go. All right, where's this Panzer at? I heard him. Mangler, you're not going to be here while the Panzer's here. No, sir. There's our boy. And he's asleep. What's up, Mangler? Gone. Honestly, it's probably better to just train down here and then use stuns and decoys to get crits. You're getting absolutely no salvage up there. It's kind of hindering us. Oh, it's just going to be a whole lot of running in circles. Uh oh, Tesla Storm. Perfect timing. Only at 25 health there. Oh, let's go. Leveling up. Oh, we found a decoy on the ground. Perfect. I feel like Mule Kick hasn't been kicking in. Usually for us, we get really good luck on whenever we throw our tacticals and just it not using it up. But not today, I guess. Leave this crawler while we go to see if we can afford some more. Also, we're 200 points away or 200 salvage away from being able to fully upgrade our hour. Round 34, we're at 999 crits. We're about to break the threshold of uh, the four digit crits. Now oh, there's a Tormentor around. I'm going up. The round will go by so much faster if I'm up here. Oh, free armor. Goodbye, Tormentors. All right. Made it through. Now we just gotta run in laps. First, gotta kill the disciple. And now we're gonna run around until all these zombies are trained up. I'll try to kill all the elites along the way, but save the rest. All right, there's a decoy for you. Let's get all these crits going. Let's Tesla storm and get some crits. Double points and a Tesla storm. The perfect storm, one might say. Except I'm getting no crits from it. Why is there so many disciples on this map? Jeez. Oh, now he's playing for me. There we go. It's kind of backpedaling and shooting is getting us a decent amount of crits. Okay, yeah, this is for sure the strat. Check this out. Hold on, once I get them all in a line here, you just kind of back up and shoot. Do this. Just jiggle peek the dead shot. I'm getting way more crits than I would be. Don't got to use anything. Just got to keep moving. My backpedal is just so fast with this tiered up stamina up that they can't get to me. Let's go. That's what we're just going to have to do for the rest of this. Now we're at 1,084 crits. Jeez. We still need to double that. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day it's gonna take so long like this gun slaps so many cheeks but this camo challenge is slapping my cheeks it's taking forever and usually at around 36 you can start to see like a gun start to fall off or you know not do as well it really just shows like how the gun really is in zombies and the hour is still basically one shot and everything and we don't even have it fully tiered up this thing is a monster Oh, what's up, Panzer? See, look, it's still even dominating a Panzer. Not dead yet, but he will be. There we go. Right here. And now. Oh, we have enough to upgrade this now, so we'll do that after this round. And we'll see its true power. 
I think the task force barrel was the right call on this. That extra damage is so, so noticeable. All right, let's upgrade it. Got it gold. We'll upgrade the rest of our armor. And let's see how much damage this does in one headshot. 17,000 something. I feel like it's more than that. It looked like there's numbers overlapping over each other. Let's see if this would be better with a decoy. Let me take out the mangler first so he doesn't ruin the party. There we go. Uh-oh, our train's already kind of messed up. Okay, there's our decoy. I think Shatter Blast went off. Or Brain Rot's just taking them all. But that still wasn't bad. Uh-oh. Took a little decoy on him. Ooh, gotta move. This is definitely gonna be a long one to edit. I've already been recording for an hour and 12 minutes. This is the most, like, polarizing weapon to me. Because it's just so good in zombies. But it takes so long to get gold. Shotguns just take forever, for whatever reason. All right, these disciples need to leave. Goodbye. Good riddance. Oh, come on, Shatter Blast. You don't have to do that. Three big bull. Round 39, and we still have... Oh, my Atlanta. Probably like 800 or more crits to go. This is going to put me to sleep. This is like so rhythmic and methodical. It's going to put me to bed. This reminded me of the Ironhide grind. Ironhide was awful. It shot so slow. You had to be so accurate with it to get the headshots. It's kind of like the same thing. This gun's actually good. Oh, there's our rotten camo. We're all done with normal kills. Finally, we see one completion camo at like round 40. Oh, there's our threshold camo. So 1,000 crits from now. 1,000 or 2,321 crits and we're done. Oh, so many crits to go. I said round 46 we'd be done, but I don't even know about that. This might be round 50. This might be one of those games. I honestly might just start doing trials to keep myself entertained. Yeah, never mind. I'm not going to the electronics store. I feel like we're not going to get out of here until we hit health cap, which is at round 55. We're going to be here for a minute. Is there a better trial to do now? Nope. It literally just went from electronics store to grocery store. I'm not doing it. Round 44. We're in this for the long haul. Still need about 700 crits. I'm gonna lose my mind. Come here, Panzer. Get out of here. No Panzer's giving me trouble so far this game. That's just how elite the Hauer is. There's gonna be so much of this video that I just cut out because it's just me looping around, doming zombies. That's it. It's all just this, but for hours. I've been recording for an hour and a half now. Usually these things take about like 45 minutes to an hour. We're gonna be doubling our time here today. Putting in overtime. We put in the work, we put in the hours just to take what's ours. Oh, because it, it really at the end of the day, it's all about driving. It's all about power. Yeah, I was predicting round 46. Not even close. We're gonna have to go way further than that. Oh, there's our chemical camo. 2,500 kills while packed. So we have our chemical and our rotten. All we're waiting on is these crits. How close are we? 1,600 out of 2,800 possible. Jeez. That just shows the, the pellet spread on the shotgun if you're further away. All right, round 46. This is where I thought we'd be done by now. And we are not. Still a lot to do here. This is what I was talking about, about having like $250,000 and nothing to spend it on. I got everything. You know what? I'll even go buy Tombstone. Let's make sure we have absolutely everything we can purchase. All right, there we go. The forbidden perk. Oh shit, no! Come on. Somebody get close to me so I can electric cherry them. There we go. Make our way back up. Gotta get our perks back. There we go. We got them and we're out. Back to safety. Okay, so that's our third down of this game. First down doesn't count. That was just me being stupid. Second down, I go I cornered myself that time. And this last time I'm I played pretty dumb as well. All my downs are just me being dumb, so they don't count. You're kidding. I'm down again. I really need armor. I'm stuck. I can't move. Right, here we go. What? Somebody come here so I can electric cherry them. Where why is my electric cherry not going off? There we go. Let's head on up i'm gonna pop my tesla storm immediately we're going down twice in the same round i'm playing very dumb i had to talk about not using the money and now we needed to use it twice you said oh you don't need money okay let's see how much you actually need it it's literally just insurance around 48 we have 1777 crits we still need about 400 probably more than that way more than that actually we need about five six hundred i'm gonna lose my mind after this i'm making some french toast sticks and i'm gonna chill all right we made it to the big 5-0 100 or 1867 crits out of the 2300 that we need i'm freaking out no i'm down again and i'm back up let's grab this 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 one this one that one and even that one now we're only at a hundred thousand we fell off plus ratio oh we got a panzer and a mangler sitting in a tree a-i-s-s-i-n-g gun's still doing decent at round 50. I'm curious to see what it does to that health cap. It's still doing pretty good against the zombies. The elites are definitely tanking more damage than they normally would, but it's not like we can't deal with it. Where you at, Panzer? There he is. 
Yeah, it's still doing a good amount of damage to him, but he's doing just as much back to me. Oh, shit. He dead? Did he die? Yeah, I think he died. <laughs> I think he got like dead wired to death. Idiot. But we're almost about to break the 2000 crit mark. Our eliminations has far surpassed our crits. We're still going around 53, two rounds away from health cap, and we just hit 2010 crits. What was big in 2010? Big time rush? Or was that before their time? All I know is you only live once, so you got to live a big time. Or it's the only life you got, so you got to live a big time. Damn, I'm a fake fan. No, I went down the second I activated my Tesla storm. Oh, shit. There we go. Right back up. And there we are. Let's see if this thing still one shots at health cap. Just to prove to you guys how menacing this weapon is, but how grueling the challenges are for it. We're at 4,000 eliminations now and half that in crits. Okay, here's a zombie. One shot. Still one shots at health cap. The zombie's health does not get any higher than this round. And it still just absolutely demolishes these zombies. Still goes in. Or at least, you know, I, I was talking about being able to buy salvage with points earlier. Even if they don't want to do that, there should be like a machine where it's like put in money and get some sort of salvage reward for it. Like it gives you like a kill streak at random, a tactical or lethal at random. I think that would be a nice way to do it. There we go. We survived the health cap round. 2,221 crits. We're one crit off from all twos. But man, this has been such a long, long grind. And we're only 100 crits away, I feel like. Please, let it end this round. Let the torture end. This round's been going on so long that exfil window closed during it. It opened and closed during this round. So I don't even know if we'll be able to exfil. It would be interesting to see. We've already come this far. We might as well do that. Uh, round 57, baby. 2,283 crits. This has to be the round. This has to be the one that we finally get our gold viper and get out of here. I can't take it anymore. We're at 2,298 crits. This could be it. I'm pretty sure we had to get into the 2,300 range to get this done. No, I'm dead. Oh, wait. No, I'm living. I'm alive. Shout out armor. Don't shout out this mangler though, because he's dead. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Run. Come on. Just a few more crits. No, disciple. Don't life steal me. You son of a bitch. We're at the finish line here. What? We made it to 58 without getting it? Damn. Okay, I guess go repair my armor. How much does it cost to repair armor? Because I only have 80 salvage. I, oh, I wasted a... It's 250. And I wasted a stun. There should be a way to convert blue salvage into green salvage too. Because I almost have 5,000 blue salvage and no green. And green is what I need. Is that our last crit though? Finally, we did it. We're all, we're all done. Oh, man. We finally finished it. But with that, I'm going to try to skip all the way until exfil. So that way I can show you guys what X filling at this round's like. At least with a shotgun. I already promised it. Oh, it's an easy round. Let's go. So I guess I'll go to set up an electric room and just be ready to leave. They're just gonna give us tormentors. A free round. Please don't crash. I'm waiting right by the walkie-talkie. All right, there we go. Starting the X fill immediately. Let's get out of here. We got two minutes to get out. We only have one Gersh, no nades. We have a Tesla Storm. And we have a chopper gunner. I think we can still get out of here. Honestly, x fills aren't that difficult. Knock on wood. Me saying that just guaranteed my death. But I'm a gamer. We can get through it. A okay, Tesla storm immediately. Let's get as many kills as we can before we hit the chopper gunner. Already taken out so many. Okay, there goes our Gersh. Now it's chopper gunner. Only 24 left. So this should be pretty simple. Oh, yeah. They're all gone. They're all sleeping. 17 left. Where? What are they underneath? Let's try to get a different angle here. We only have a minute left. Oh, there they are. They're all hiding inside. They're smart. They went after cover. Okay, six enemies left. We can take this down on our own. Two more. One. Two. Skip a few. 99, we're out of here. Go ahead, take your time. Oh, finally done. It took us 60. Well, we got it done at like round 58. But it took us 61 rounds, 4,800 eliminations, 2,043 crits, and six downs so happy to be done so happy all right let's take a look at what the howler looks like with these mastery camos on it this is gold viper honestly it's, this is not great a lot of the barrel i mean the entire barrel has no coverage on it and where you see the gold viper on it it still has like the wood finish behind it and it's like scraped off like it's not completely flawless which is really kind of annoying to be honest but that's it with gold viper like diamond definitely much better play diamond always does it right uh the metal becomes that nice purple metal and then everything else the diamonds are pretty good 
And then Dark Aether, this is where I don't mind the barrel being like that because just Dark Aether looks sick. So let's go ahead, hop in game and see what this thing looks like in there with Gold Viper. All right, this is what the Howard looks like with Gold Viper in game. Definitely way better in game. You don't really see any of the wood really once you're holding it. Uh, you can kind of see it right where the stock reaches part of the, the gun by the, the trigger. I don't know. I'm not, a, I'm not a gun expert, but that little line there where you can see where you put on the stock, you can see some wood still rubbing through. Same on the pump, but honestly, not too bad. Let's do a nice little spin with it. Try to keep it stable. See where we can get the best lighting for it. That's not bad. But yeah, this is the Hauer. There you have it. That's an extremely long grind. This recording took how long? Two hours and 34 minutes now that I'm looking at it. So that is ridiculous. That was excruciating, but this thing does slap. We made it all the way to round 60 with little to no issue. So this is a gun. This is like the gun. But with that, I have to go edit this thing. So I'm gonna have to end the video here. If you guys like this and you wanna see more, go ahead and leave a like on it. If you didn't, you don't dislike. If you're new here, please start subscribe and put out all kinds of content throughout the week. That's gonna be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.